Welcome back to episode 2 of Imperial Architect, the mod for Prison Architect. The mod where you create your own for-profit prison. Now, what we are going to do at this point in time... Well, I guess we should still keep working towards uh, goals of harmony and uh, trying to keep the uh, sounds of chaos to a minimum for now until we are established. One thing we could use to help in this endeavor is a yard. I really don't want to give them too much freedom, but I guess we'll go ahead and do it for now. Yeah, I guess we can make it over here. No, this wrong button. We are going to use a fence. We are going to fence off this area of the prison this is dead wrong we need down one more there we go yeah that seems like it's a decent size and then let me see objects I want a large jail door here I would also like to begin where are our metal detectors? Metal detectors, we're going to start harassing you guys. Since I know they're going to be trying to steal stuff out of the uh, canteens, kitchen, so forth. Now we are also going to start... Oh, we can't get deployment. Deployment's unlocked through bureaucracy. Where is deployment? Up here. We need that stuff to kick into high gear. Let's go back into fast forward. Hmm. Trying to figure out where I can build and what I can build in what areas. Now what I'm thinking is we could probably build our hospital, our infirmary, right here. We can build it here. Let's see, uh, take a door out. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Well, we have a yard. Oh, is the fence finished? Yes, it is. So, rooms. We're about to finish this uh, basic detention center. We needed a yard to qualify for our grant. There we go. We now have that set. Visitors, people are waiting to visit. Well, let me see here. Foundations. We're going to add another hallway on this side. Bringing us down to this portion of the building. And I guess we could add a visitor's room but I have to add a door here hmm let me see I do want an area they have to come in through there we're gonna do it like this we're gonna have a three this is gonna be the searching area I guess reception and if one no reception is gonna be over here next to the holding cell here we go see we're starting to figure stuff out starting to make these plans let's go back to my planning drawing this is gonna be my reception correct how big does reception have to be do, are, do are we even able to add reception yes we can Indoors, office desk, table, chair. Materials, concrete walls. This is going to be our infirmary over here. This is our hospital. Alright, let's see. Objects. Now, for the hospital, let's see. Rooms, we want infirmary. I could have sworn I seen it could have sworn I had seen it. Oh, 
we have to unlock health. Okay, so back to reception. All you require is office desk, table, chair. Office desk, table, and chair. We are going to put them on, yeah, this side. Office desk, table, and chair. Why do we need such a big table? I don't know. I guess I'll have a little bit of put all your stuff on that table over there. Alright. Reception. Reception has now been installed. We have an extra, you know, notch in the unit, I guess. You know what we could do? because these are going to be more offices. Let's start working on this. They're going to need to be one, two, three, four to be an office. So this wall is going to have to come down this way. Hmm. Yeah, let's start doing this number here. Let me see, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Yeah, we just copied that. That's perfect. We're going to go with this as well. Concrete walls. Let's get these offices in. We'll leave a gap at the bottom for now. More offices. Now we do need more utilities. Let's see. We need electrical cables running this way. We'll add electrical cables running this way. We'll add water pipes coming down this hall here. Small pipe there. Our utilities up and running. We have we need a storage room. All right, now this is going to be objects. I want a solitary door, and I want a solitary door. Yeah, okay, that'll be that. And then I will go ahead and build walls, concrete walls. Yeah, we'll do the walls like this. It's going to be a small visiting room, but it's okay. It's not my problem. They shouldn't have came here if they wanted to spend time on the outside. Shouldn't have got caught anyway. So let's see. Rooms. We're going to make this a visitation room. Visitation, objects, visitors table. Yeah, we're doing all right here. Yeah, visitation. Hmm. It's only two tables. Aw, oh, man. I guess we'll do it like this. These is going to be cramped in here. You cancel. Should it be this way? It, I mean, it's really cramped in here, is all I'm saying. No, we'll do it like that. Only three tables, that's all you guys got. Now out here, I do know we are going to need phones later. So we're going to go ahead and add some, uh, oh, well, let's see. We could be nice. We will give them one. No, not there. We're going to start you guys off at one, two, and three workout benches. Phones. One, two, three, four, five. I gave you guys five. You can't say I'm not nice. I'm a very fair warden. 
Yeah, we are going to need materials. Demolish these two walls right there. Utilities. We need electrical cable here. I guess we'll build that up a little further. How are we doing on that capacitor? It is... Well, we need more capacitors to increase. Uh-oh, we're running low on money. What does this mean? Eight out of eight. We have two minimum security. And how many I can hold? The number of prisoners. Maximum safe capacity is eight. Is it because of we're low on staff? Let me see. No. Well, if we only have eight, I mean, we built... We built a lot of, uh... A lot of cells here. Let's go ahead and take in another eight. But I don't want any minimum security. I only want the mediums. Okay, that's how we're going to do it. I mean, how come we don't have deployment yet? Oh, we need a security officer. So staff, we need a security chief Get down here. Oh, we don't have enough money? Oh, come on. We need to come up with more money. We will get more money as soon as these next prisoners arrive here. About 30 minutes. 20 minutes will be here in a couple of seconds. I'm just playing with you guys. Here they come. We're bringing in our new prisoners. Blam, they get dropped off. Now here come the guards. We're going to grab them. I just kind of want to follow them this time. So they bring them inside the prison and they come to reception. Should we add another another guard? Well, we need money. All right, well, we do need a higher, I mean, uh, research. So let's go to bureaucracy. I need you to get deployment because we need guys inside those deployment and patrols. I don't want to blow all our money just yet. Looks like they're being stripped, searched, and everything in reception. That'll help cut down on contraband coming into the prison. We are also going to turn off our prisoner intake. We have 16 people. Objects, drains. What's the problem? We have 18 cells. We we'll, we brought in what's what's going on with our cells. You come up here. Let's take a look. Oh, that's what happened. Rooms. I forgot to designate these as cells. There we go. Now these are cells. There we go. Now we're all, we'll have a good amount of money. We need another guard. Open up those doors. There we go. Let the families out. They go away. More families are waiting to come in to visit. Here we go. See, we we're starting to make we're starting to have a little progress going here. Now we can't check out their needs, so we don't know why they're upset really. Until we have a psychologist, who also needed an office there. We have a thousand. Oh wait, we're almost broke again. All right, now we are taking care of our prisoners. We could use an infirmary. Let's see what other grants we can get real quick. Um, 
administration center, hire, build two offices, hire a warden, hire an accountant. That'll get us five. We just need an accountant. Blank. More money. Okay, more grants. We are going to go with cell block A. Ooh, that was 40000 in our pocket. That's not bad. Health and well-being. We need a medical ward. Hire at least two doctors. Health and well-being. Where's what we're going to do? We're going to make this a infirmary. We need a door on that. We're going to make it a staff door. And then you need, what do you need? Just medical beds. Medical bed. Let me stop that. Let me see. Hmm. I don't know how I want to set this up. Okay, let's do a bed here, a bed here, a bed here, a bed here. We will do a bed here. I don't want to block the door. There, we'll have five beds. That's good enough. No, you know what? We'll go ahead and we'll add an office desk. Cause someone needs to keep track of what patients we have in the room. And uh, we'll add a chair for them to sit in. There. Now it's looking nice. What do you guys think of that? Alright, we need more doors here. We're going to make these staff doors. Because there should never be any prisoners back here, really. These are going to be more rooms. Let me see, for now... We do need a psychologist, so we're going to build another office. We need an office desk, chair, and filing cabinet. And then we will hire our psychologist, correct? Yes. Health and well being. Oh, we need two doctors. Uh, where are our doctors? Two doctors. Well, what happened? Okay, let me turn that off. Let me see, where's this prisoner? What's up with this prisoner? What's up with these guys? Prisoner in solitary. Oh, found drugs. We need to be able to lock these guys up in solitary. Which I guess we could add a little solitary wing in here, correct? Let me see, if we added a wall... Right? Now solitaries we can make smaller. Let's make this a wall. Wall. Let's see, we'll do it like this. Man, bang, bang. Hmm. Or I guess what we'll do is we'll do it like this. We will make it, starting from there, we'll make a two-sided hallway. I mean a two-spaced hallway leading to this. You'll see what I mean here in a second. These are going to be our solitary cells. We need a place to keep these guys when they misbehave. Let's see, this is going to be there like this. See, this is going to be how we, uh, this is going to be how we set up our solitary. So here we go. We need walls. See, I like planning stuff out first. 
make sure I like the way it, it looks, it fits together. And we need these solitaries in order to start, you know, being able to find the snitches and hire them and have them work for us. So of course we need objects. We're going to need more solitary doors. Let's just start with a few for now. Oh, here we go. Do we have patrols yet? Yes, we do. Guard patrols. We want to start setting up patrols as soon as possible here so we can keep an eye on everything that's going on in our prison. I'll just have you walk back and forth here. There's another guard. I want a guard deployed in the uh, canteen. I want a guard out here in the yard. So we're going to have to hire more guards. There we go. How come these guys aren't being put away? Oh, they're waiting for solitary. So we need to turn these into solitaries there we go now one thing I want to get into is oh we, we haven't researched policy we have a lot of things that need research. We want to research prison processy, contraband, we want dogs. Let me see, we do want maintenance. We want cloning because that makes building easier. We want prison labor cleaning, groundskeeping. I know it's all very expensive, but we will make that money back as soon as possible. Utilities. Let's get some more capacitors to keep us from overloading. There, that's an investment we we're going to have to make eventually, either way. Staff door here, staff door here. Did I put a guard? We need a door up here, so objects. Staff door. Come on guys, I need you to move quicker than that. Hold on a second, is he a potential SI? No. Alright, back to normal speed. Let's see what else we can get. Prison and maintenance. Guess we could do that one. Visitation rights. We need a common room and add a pool table. Alright, then we are going to make this concrete wall. Let's see, room here, we want a common room. We wanted to add a couple of TVs, if I recall. Pool table and two TVs, objects. I guess we could just put a regular door on it. We're only putting a regular door on it so that way they uh, they can find their own ways around it. And they can let themselves in. We're not going to be constantly sending you know, guards over here to let prisoners into a, a room that's a privilege to them anyways. And we will give you guys small little sofas to watch your TVs on. Uh, 
There we go. I guess we could add a second pool table now that I made those closer. There. Those don't even look like pool tables. Look like some they're playing poker or something. All right, there we go. That should brought us in more money. Yes, it did. So we need two janitors. We need to hire a foreman. So in order to hire a foreman, we need what? Another office. Let's go ahead and throw this office on here. Objects, chair, office, desk, and of course a filing cabinet. Once those are installed, we'll be able to hire our foreman. So staff here, we needed a foreman. There we go. All right, everybody. We're going to go ahead and call that the end of uh, episode two. See you guys next time.